All right, so once again, greetings from World's End State Park here in Pennsylvania. Got here yesterday, had a great time, despite the rainy conditions and stuff. Found out my tent was waterproof. Um, yeah, and just this morning we hiked a cold run trail. Had some beautiful rock formations and uh, waterfalls and stuff. So I got back from that, changed, soaking wet from the rain and humidity. Although it feels a little bit less humid right now, actually. But anyway, took a little nap, ate lunch, now we're gonna get on going. We're gonna go try to check out what's called Cottonwood Falls. I'm gonna drive to that location. It, there's a little park area a little bit down the road. Go ahead and drive the trailhead and see what this place is like. Cottonwood Falls. Hopefully it's a little bit bigger than some of the waterfalls that we were at this morning. They were nice waterfalls, but nice to see a little bit larger one. It's located on what's called the Double Run Nature Trail. So let's uh, let's hop in Naomi and let's uh, get to the trailhead. Yeah, so here we are, the Double Run nature trail right here this is the main highway right through world's end route 87 and i'm not sure if there was a fox just running down the road here a few moments ago i'm not sure if i i tried to get on film we'll see how that turns out if it's if the film is off i won't show it but i think i got a few clips maybe that are good yeah he just kind of ran off that way that's pretty cool and there's a fox trotting on down the road there there's the cameras There's a fox down there. And some of these shoes roll left here. These are just little shoes. These are my hands, some little kids. All right. And this is what they call the chapel. I thought there was gonna be a building here. All right, so Cottonwood Falls. Let's see what this place looks like. The, the stream over there is flowing pretty good, so hopefully we get a good waterfall. Not so many mosquito bites. <laughs> It fit me up pretty bad early this morning when I was hiking, but you know, that's the price you pay. To be out here, it's beautiful though. Yeah, you should be able to hear a stream flowing off. Just to our right down there. So there's still a break in the rain. I'm taking advantage of these breaks and getting some hiking in. And when it's been raining, go back to the tent, take a nap. Thankfully, it hasn't been too bad today. Before I came, the forecast was basically like today would just be a complete washout, but thankfully that hasn't been so. Oh, that looks beautiful up there. Okay, this is a beautiful trail. You can see the falls. I don't know if that's, yeah. I don't think it's Cottonwood Falls, but that's a beautiful spot. Well, let's see what the view is looking over the top. Yeah, wow. Yeah, we should be able to get closer. Yeah, so I just double checked the map and, and this is not Cottonwood Falls yet. I didn't think it was. A little bit more ways to go to, for that. But wow. Nice little treat. Yeah, pretty awesome. Let's see what else this trail has to offer. Oh, 
right, so we just come across that bridge over there, and here it gets a little confusing. You can continue on, the green blazes continue on that way, the double run trail. There's also, a, yeah, a couple other trails, but uh, I don't want to go that way. I don't want to go this way either with the yellow blaze, that's the something about the East Branch Trail, but the Double Run Trail does loop back this way too. And this is also the Loyal Sock Trail. So I'm going to follow the green and the X. So I'm going to get on over here. This will take me to Cottonwood Falls. At least that's the plan. I guess we got to go across another bridge and head up that way, I think. I'll check, I'll check the map one more time, but the whole slew of trails join right here. Kind of confusing. Yeah, LT is the Loyal Sock Trail. So that was a bit confusing, but I just double checked the map. Yeah, so our trail should go this way. Yeah. So we're following the Green Blaze and the Loyal Sock Trail. And another trail goes that way, but that's a link trail. Yeah. Alright. I think we made the right choice. You can do the whole double run trail. It does make a loop, but I just want to go in a section that goes to the falls right now. So this is what we're following right now. The green blaze and the yellow circle. This is LT for Loyal Sock Trail. But eventually those two split off from each other too. I hear water. Ooh, another waterfall. Got a beautiful little cluster of mushrooms down here. Not sure offhand what they are, but. And here's another trail split. We are going to stay on the green blazed double run trail, but the Loyal Sock Trail goes off the right. You can see one of the yellow badges up there. So we're going to go to the left here. Stay, stay along the creek. And Cottonwood Falls should be just up here a little ways according to the map it is just an absolutely beautiful stream valley down there you've already had some really you know pretty awesome waterfalls they didn't have names so Cottonwood Falls should be bigger than those these are definitely bigger than the ones we saw this morning on the cold run trail. Alright, so I feel like we're nearing something. As soon as I walked down here, I felt a blast of cooler air. Which can often mean a waterfall. I think Oh, I see. I see the bottom of it there. Looks like we should be able to get down to the bottom, but let's go up here. Wow, this trail is beautiful. It just goes on up. Look at that.
Alright, so I'm going to walk up this trail just a little bit more. So I'm pretty sure this is Cottonwood Falls. But uh, we're going to walk on a little bit further. It's beautiful along here, so why not? Yeah, just so many beautiful cascades down there. Well, that was a good idea to keep coming. There's another beautiful waterfall. I see a bigger one up there, so I guess we, we were not at Cotton, Cottonwood Falls back there. Yeah, right there's another one. Yeah, this one's beautiful too. Wow. Okay, I see a, another totally awesome spot up there. Yeah, the trail didn't indicate that there were... Oh, I see an even bigger one beyond it. Wow. I think I do. Oh yeah, there is. And yeah, there's this cool one right here, but then I think way up there I see something. Wow. Yeah, I didn't realize there's gonna be so many waterfalls on this trail. It's amazing. And none of them so far are Cottonwood Falls. So I'm guessing it's the big one up here. Wow, I can feel super cool breeze coming off that. Like little curtains coming off there. Wow. All right, let's get down there. Yeah, you even have some little, I guess we'd call curtain falls coming off the edge there. Wow. Beautiful out here. You're just following the trail up a little bit more, and it just continues to be beautiful spots here. It's amazing. Right up here is where the trail loops across the river, or the stream here. And you, you can make a larger loop. This just goes very steeply. You can see some steps over there. It goes very steeply up the mountain. It'll take you back to where we came from, too. But. 
Yeah, so awesome trail. I do have a completely wet foot now. I was getting that one shot in front of the falls where I'm kind of walking out or hunched down in front of it. Yeah, that rock was slippy. In goes my foot. Not all of me, just the foot, but oh well. They were already pretty wet anyway. Plus, I have dry socks and I have another pair of dry shoes back at the Jeep. So, it's all good. Beautiful place. But now begins the trek back. Let's go back the way we came and I'll get to enjoy all those waterfalls again. Starting with the big one, Cottonwood Falls. Yep, farewell to Cottonwood Falls. Absolutely beautiful spot here. Hopefully I'll get back here again someday. Yeah, so just taking a little break here in the chapel area, right next to the parking lot. But yeah, absolutely beautiful hike. Exceeded my expectations. You know, I knew there was going to be a waterfall, but I didn't realize there was going to be so many waterfalls. So that was, that was awesome. Because I thought each one was maybe Cottonwood Falls, but there's that. Wait till the end. There's the one big one at the end that's Cottonwood Falls. They probably should have signs along the trail system pointing to Cottonwood Falls. Because like I said, the one spot, it got kind of confusing. There were so many trails joining together and going everywhere, different colored blazes. It was a little bit confusing, but uh, we found it. So anyway, if you want to hike this trail, awesome trail. All right, I got to figure out what I'm going to do. It's starting to rain again. Um, yeah, tomorrow I'm doing the Canyon Vista hike. I'm going to save that one tomorrow. All right, as always, thanks for coming along, and uh, I'll see you around.